Welcome back. Let's get things started out there this morning. Clouds currently moving through. We had some showers and storms last night and early this morning. Probably woke a few of you up, but now we're starting to calm things down. The clouds will break up to give way to a little bit of sunshine coming up later on. Here's our zoomed in picture for, for the courthouse coming in from our sky cam on the roof of the station. Notice a little bit hazy out there in the distance as well. For now, this is fog that's developing out there, but wildfire smoke will be moving back in. So that's kind of an unfortunate situation there. We'll be approaching from the northwest going to the south and east along with that cold front that'll be passing through today. And notice it will stick around even through parts of Saturday before we catch a little bit of a break in a few spots again as we head towards early Sunday morning. So here's the air quality forecast for today. Moderate air quality is what's going to be expected today. For now, everyone's in the green, but further off towards the west, so Minnesota air quality alerts supposed to because their forecast is to reach up to code orange air quality today, which is considered unhealthy for the sensitive groups. But otherwise, though, we're watching clouds moving from the west going to the east along with some showers and storms. Those have since gotten out of here. We've had a little bit of development in southern Wisconsin as well. Notice that started to taper off just a bit too. So we're in a little bit of a lull for now. We'll be watching for more action off from the west into the north and west too as we head towards the afternoon period for a few showers and thunderstorms. Not widespread but localized and also move through today and also in the parts of tonight. We could use any kind of rain although we could use a good widespread rain. The new drought monitor has since come in and we're in moderate drought for a good part of the north woods. Some severe drought to the south and also to the west and extreme drought expanding further down to the south too. So not a good situation there. We could use a lot of rain, unfortunately. We just can't seem to get any at this point, though. And we'll see how things look as we head towards next Thursday when the new drought monitor comes out again. But otherwise, so a few cast moving forward, some breaks in the clouds today, a few showers and a few rumbles of thunder during the afternoon period as the smoke moves in, too. Notice as we head towards early Saturday morning, we catch a little bit of a break, but more showers and storms possible as we head towards Saturday afternoon again. We'll push that through. And then by Saturday night to Sunday, it looks like we'll catch a little bit of a break. But otherwise, though, your muggy mirror showing two points. So remaining in the 50s, but temperatures not too far away from the dew points. So that's why it feels a little muggy out there this morning. But otherwise, though, dew point wise, we're looking okay. We look, we look to be rather comfortable for the next several days. But otherwise, though, temperatures right now, upper 50s in Lando Lakes and Manswish Waters. Other spots, though, in the upper 50s to lower 60s, middle 60s over in Stevens Point this morning. Average high temperature, 80 degrees. Lower 80s today and tomorrow. Middle 70s Sunday, we cool off a bit. Lower 70s Monday, middle 70s Tuesday. Back in the upper 70s to lower 80s Wednesday. Wednesday and also in your Thursday. The UV index forecast for today will be at an 8 that's considered very high, a burn time of 15 minutes. So hats, sunglasses, sunscreen, shade will be necessary to avoid a bad sunburn today. But otherwise, moving forward, partly cloudy with a few showers and storms on the way later this afternoon. Hazy again, highs at the low 80s and at west wind getting up around 20 miles per hour. By tonight, though, partly cloudy, a few showers and thunderstorms again also becoming hazy. Lows in the upper 50s and a southwest wind at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. North winds, furniture, and mass. A seven day forecast. Storms continue through Sunday. Temperatures in the 70s and 80s. A few showers as we head towards your Monday. Tuesday, we're dry. Then Wednesday and Thursday, we're looking good for a while, though, but a few storms on the way and temperatures in the upper 70s.